weather. Yeah, it's such a dynamic system bringing feet of snow to Denver, Fort Collins, in places of Montana around as well. Wow. So some of the biggest snows since maybe 2003 wow. in terms of accumulations for one storm event. So an incredibly dynamic system and it will move east and impact us as okay. we head toward the week ahead. So we actually do have the chance for some strong storms too on Wednesday. About 57 right now in Atlanta, 55 in Marietta, also in Athens, Rome 54. The average high this time of year is 64. So once again, incredibly warm start and it will be a really warm day. We did hit 80 degrees yesterday, the first 80 degree temperature since October 29th. Well above 15 degrees, even more than that for some of you. And we will have another 80 degree day today. And it's kind of the end of the line because we do have a storm system moving in, bringing a really unsettled week. So here we are in Atlanta. There's that stationary front still to the north with clouds, a few showers. But this is the big impactful event. Here's the area of low pressure, just kind of pummeling Denver. But also you can see some very stormy conditions in Omaha. Threat for severe weather once again today in the plains, including Texas and Oklahoma. Again, that threat stays well west of us today, but it is a piece of that storm ejects into the east, into the southeast, and will be impactful for us this week. Here's the forecast for today. Again, a day very similar to yesterday, kind of a high overcast with some filtered sunshine. And with that, that's what we will see. A dry day for the most part, maybe a sprinkle or two, but mostly dry conditions. Even into tomorrow, the first part of tomorrow is dry with just cloudy, dry conditions. But it's not till tomorrow around dinner time. We're going to watch the beginning of wet weather. Look at this potent storm potentially tomorrow evening around Rome. So you'll first see it west of the metro area. The rain moves then in late Monday night. So the balance of tomorrow is dry until after dinner time, and then we'll see that rain west to east. Here's a bigger picture. So this is Monday. Monday night, the first wave of rain moves through into Tuesday. Tuesday, kind of some on and off showers. Wednesday, a wetter day. Wednesday, we do have the chance for some showers and thunderstorms. And then into Thursday morning. And then the whole system exits east by Thursday afternoon. So it's really late Monday night. Rain on Tuesday, some strong storms potentially Wednesday. Rain moves out Thursday morning and we're dry Thursday afternoon. So that's the time period for the weather. For today, partly sunny, 80 degrees in Atlanta, 79 in Rome, cloudier skies to the north in LJ, 78 partly sunny, 82 today in LaGrange. Here's tomorrow's forecast, mostly dry, cloudy skies, 68. So this is the beginning of the temperature changing, and we're going to watch that come down. So the pollen forecast again high today, mostly for trees, moderate tomorrow and then low Tuesday and Wednesday when the rain moves in. Here's the seven day forecast, Atlanta's most accurate forecast. Today, partly sunny, very warm 80. Tomorrow, cloudy skies, rain moves in tomorrow after dinner. Tuesday, scattered rain showers only in the 50s. 63 with some storms on Wednesday and then on Thursday we'll see rain in the morning moves out in the afternoon sets the stage for dry skies but a lot cooler Friday and Saturday partly sunny only in the low 60s. Well, I don't know now that we've hit 80 we're going to be spoiled. <laughs> it's hard to go back right and then on Saturday first official day of spring. All right mm -hmm. okay nowhere to go up but here.